We we back in the building. We are back in the building. We are back in the dang building. We back. We back in this. <laughs> you thought I was We back in this. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> They're holding this All right, folks. We back at the house. Jet up, rigging tackle. I probably need to be rigging tackle, but I already rigged my tackle. Hey, I did good this week. Let's go see what these boys got. Avena and DC. Check on them. I'm always trying to learn something from my competition. So we're going to start off. You ain't going to here, bub. Why? Huh? Look at this. You, you done told me everything I know. Adrian got some. Look at this, huh? man. Huh? Hey, wait, what you doing, man? What, 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 what do they know what about is, that? What is man? that, man? Huh? I don't know. You got a tote full of goodies? Some know. robo worm? Oh, oh, I can't be getting you in trouble, huh? I don't want to get you in trouble. Them is all nah, Berkeley, y'all. Nah, That's you, all you Berkeley. All good. <laughs> hey, what about what about what about that one hook, man? You showed me about. Hmm? Oh yeah, that's the truth. Hmm. But you know, hey, hey, y'all don't know about this hook right here. We know that hook that. right there, I ain't gonna even show y'all too much. That's a excellent hook right there. I'm a big time owner guy. I used to be sponsored with owner, but that's the one hook I cheat on owner with for sure. It's a Daiichi. I'm just gonna give it up to y'all. It's a Daiichi. Y'all do some homework on that Daiichi. He's a pretty dang on good hook. We got some. Leave it to the beers. We got some square bills. We got some. Okay. Hey, the problem is this time of year, there's just a lot going on, man. I know. You don't know what to rig up. Uh, everything bit. plays this time of year. I got a little bit of everything. Yeah, you probably got 25 rods in there about like me. Oh, easy. Yeah. I can't even get the bottom one. Not, you can't? Uh-uh. <laughs> I know, cause that look, cause you already know. As soon as you launch them all, that's the one you need. The one that's on the bottom. What else you got for me? What you know about him? Man, you showed me this thing a long time ago, but I ain't never thrown it. That's a goofy looking lure. What you call him? What's he called? I don't even know what he's called. What is he called, Jacob? I know you showed me that one time and I was like, okay, what the hell is that? You say it worked kind of like top water, huh? It sounds like a plopper. What? Oh, yeah. It sounds like a plopper. But they get, but, but, but when they but when they get him, you got him. Oh yeah, you got him on a hook. Yeah, you got him on a single him. hook, he ain't coming off. Yeah. yeah, that's legit. Don't be showing that on video though. Too late, bro. Do not be showing. Well, that. What are they gonna do? Right. Do not. Hey, what are you gonna do? You gonna try to make hey, look. this? Come dude, on. Do come not on. show that. Do not. <laughs> do not. Yo, Jacob is so sneaky. Dude, I'm man. telling you, that is not even, dude. That is something. Do not put that on video. Hey, the hey, one word. bait Jacob Wheeler didn't want you to know what it was. <laughs> <laughs> it's this one right here. Literally, they can do that right now. Title for a hey, that's the, that's a whole video right there. That is. That's oh. a whole video. All right, let's see what Sizzle got popping. He got some Guggen popping. So that popping, body armor. Your Red Crest champion. Go down. Yeah, they ain't even got to catch a couple big ones. I just got to catch a bunch of them. I probably need to go tie me on a couple baits. I got I got so many already tied on. You know, you, you got all these preconceived notions. What you gonna throw, how the tournament's gonna go down, and of course, once you get here, all that changes, like bad. So, I got like 25 rods in the box. We got a little bit of everything. Strong, strong pre-spawn spawn tournament, I'm, I'm assuming. I'm gonna tell you, there's literally one on bed right here in the backyard, I just saw it. I went over here, looked in the water, it's a little dingy here on Lake of the Ozarks. And there's one spawning right here in the backyard. So, a little bit of a clue, you know. There's definitely going to be some fish shallow. How are we going to catch these shallow fish is going to be the name of the game. I got a lot of things running through my mind. But, uh, I don't know. We're going to jump in the boat, tie some crickets on, and try to figure it out. Important week, man. We need, we need, a, we need a good finish this week. We need to do well. And uh, we're going to do well. Cause I'm gonna figure this bad boy out. We got two days. Lake of the Ozarks, giant lake, millions of docks. What are they gonna be doing? I don't know, but we are gonna find out. Come tomorrow, I'll be checking in with you guys. Y'all stay tuned, enjoy the ride, have a good one. I'll be back, peace. Just got up, day two of practice starts right now, heading out to the boat. I need to grab a few things, something to get lunch and stuff like that. But uh, we fished all day yesterday. I did not record 
practice yesterday because it was an absolute mess of a storm. It's nonstop rain, basically impossible to record. So we'll do a little bit today. I'm gonna bring the camera with me, but we got rain coming in again. So won't be able to get a ton of the footage. I'll be able to talk you guys kind of through what I'm thinking is going on. So water temps up here about between high 50s and low 60s and they're starting to slide up there's quite a few fish on bed um i've seen several myself caught a few problem is a lot of them are non-scoreables so we got two pound minimum this week so it's gonna be very difficult i'm gonna try my best today to get out here and locate some fish on bed that i can visually see that i know are scoreable and i think that's gonna be a big deal just because you keep fishing, fishing, fishing. You catch one pounder after one pounder after one and a half after one and three quarter. They don't help you. So we need two pounders, two pounders plus. There are some big ones swimming around too. So Lake of Ozarks has some good fish. So don't be fooled by that. But they ain't making it easy on us. I'm this guy at the rim. So I just launched my boat, poked it out there. I didn't pull it off the trailer, tie her up. Y'all let me know in the comments. Y'all hate that guy? Some people hate that guy because then your boat's out there floating around all in the way, banging on other boats. But, you know, I'm out here with all the, with all the anglers, man. Somebody gonna look out for me, help me out, take me to my boat. At least that's how I, I think, I hope. That's what I would do. I would do that for them, right? I don't know, we're gonna see how it goes. Walking down right now, I see the old, I see the old Bill Lewis boat. She floating, she about to run into somebody right now. <laughs> we're gonna see how this goes. Check her out. Oh, she blowing right into the dock, right where it needs to go. Lindner would help me out though. Oh, this is gonna work out great, you guys. <laughs> What's that? Yeah, I'll get you. Hey, you could just let her go. Look at mine. Just going right into the dock. But I mean, hey, don't 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 trust me for that. I know she a little different. She float a little different, bro. But either way, I'll get you though. So when you come back, I'll take you to Rick. Yeah. All right, see I told you Leonard gave me, but check that out, on command. She just floated right on into the dock. I didn't even have to tell her to do that. Psh. Now that's how you do it right there. That, that's how, that's how it's done. Straight up, look at this. As I'm walking up to the dock, it's literally meeting me right here. Unbelievable. Last day of practice. It's a beautiful morning, overcast, winds blowing about, I don't know, seven or eight mile an hour. Water temps 58. It's springtime up here, man. It's a late spring up here. I didn't realize, come up north a little bit. So we're in Missouri, Osage Beach. Dude, all the fish at the house are post spawn. They're done spawning already. They did their deal in, in like March. It's over with. Here, they're just getting started. It's crazy. And I imagine the further north you go, it just gets pushed back. May and in some cases into June, so. But uh, I think there's gonna be a lot of sight fishing this week. A lot of fish on bed. But I caught some on square bill too. There's still some pre-spawners, man. I mean, it's, it's, it's weird. It's really weird. I don't know. We're gonna make something work though. Something's gonna have to bite my cricket. Something. Hey, check it out. The sun is out, finally letting the boat dry out got all the compartments open but me and the fellas dc's fishing me adrian jada up and we got cafe lurche look at look at adrian's rig look at this thing he got crap everywhere son on a real look at the floor hey it's oh my god look at that line it gets better yeah we're neat boys yeah we, we get, get things in line <laughs> i mean literally from bow to stern my man got stuff yeah everywhere but that's how it golfing. is but we about to go golfing hey, i suck at golfing and they always trying to get me to go golfing so here we go i'm gonna go with my boys i'll be a good friend try to learn something i need to get some lessons from my boy demo demo i need them lessons baby when you see this hey look at this guy yeah buddy i'm a driver i'm a chef i'm a golfer you everything lurch you lurch i'm not daddy I'm not the best fisherman in the world, but that's all right. That's why I hang out with people hey. who are better than me, so I get better. That's, that's how, it. That's, that's, how we, that's how we do it, too. Look at J-Dub in the back back there. That's how. That's it right there. We're already back here, bro. What you doing back there, bro? Man, I'm trying to uh, I'm trying to research how to play golf. <laughs> oh, you for real, huh? Oh, no. 
You probably, hey, but, but no, I, but I that's something you would do, it. though. That's You're on climate control. Yeah. That's right. something J Dub would do is research how to play golf, bro, for real. <laughs> and then get hella good at it. And then you want to gamble. You want to gamble with you after you get good. Yep, facts. Oh, hey, Lurch, hit that uh, child lock, man. Oh, yeah, man, we got we got our kids in the back, man. Leave that. Hey, we got our we got our kids. We act like children. We make the car act like children. <laughs> <laughs> Let's load up the chitlins. Let's go go. Boys is ready. They got their own clubs. I bought them today. Hey, Lurch, get a little Lurch got him some. Yeah. You, got, you got any sunscreen? Got any sunscreen. Come on, Adrian, what you about to melt out here? I got balls, I got tees. I got balls, I got tees. I ain't got no sunscreen. Alright, we at we out here at the Oaks. The Oaks. Margaritaville. Osage Beach. You see it? It's clubbing time. We be clubbing. We be clubbing. Thank you. See ya. What's up? All right. So my favorite part about golfing is the golf cart. This is the highlight of the day right here. All right. So we get to roll around in one of these things, do darn donuts and burnouts in reverse. What you got, Amina? Oh, wiener? A half a pounder. A half a pounder. Adrian said he can't wait. You gotta eat right now. Got the over here. That's it. <laughs> Orange. All right, here we go. This is the best part of the golfing trip, right here. Me and J-Dub. <laughs> My guy over here in the lime green. Hey, this is it. This is the highlight of the day for me. Your boy cannot swing the club. So just riding around in this golf cart, this is where it's at. Now, low key, I should have brought my rod because that pond over there, that pond right there, I bet he got some five pounders in there. Uh -huh. Dude, it's cool cow, bro. I know. I'd say the golfing was fun. We had a oh, good time. Great time. I lost some money, so I didn't have that good of a time. Hey, you already know there were some bets thrown down on the golf course. Listen, they didn't talk me into betting. Bro, I do not know how to golf, but they always want to bet me. And then I lost. J-Dub. So, J-Dub. So look, you know what? I'm going to take it out on the bass tomorrow. That's just how it's going to be. Good luck, bass. Good luck. And right now, the luck is looking pretty good Ooh. according to Score Tracker for y'all bass. All right, we out. We got meet and greet four to six today. We're gonna hang out with the fans. Go we'll get the breeze, eat some tacos. They got free tacos for us. Oh, How about that? Look the league's looking out. Oh, paid that man in full. Fresh. Crispy. Straight from the mint. Hey, you gave me 22. I did get I don't play around. I pay my listen. For y'all in the YouTube, dead. I pay my debts, man. <laughs> I don't care if it's twenty dollars or, or eight hundred, huh? Ooh. God. Eight hundred hurts. Anyways. Was that was that on YouTube? No, that that, that was was on not. average, you make oh, it was, bucks an it was hour. on uh, Jacobs, I think, or DC's Jacobs. channel. It was not on my channel because I lost a lot of money. Twenty you bucks. Kept the ball. I, I kept the ball. Game. I kept the ball. Twenty three bucks. Hey, he you got you twenty. I never even held the money. I never even. Oh, held oh, man. Oh, oh, I never even. Hey, I'm quick draw. So we found out I'm actually not that bad at putting this horrible at golf. So if you'll play putt putt. I don't want to bet. Hey, J Dub, he's lucky and everything. Hey, boys. You about to get the best rant of all time. One hundred and ten. All time. Oh, all time. Oh, oh my boy got him. Hey, I got him. You, you know got him. Me. Hey, you we got him. Like I caught all day, baby. I got him. I got him. We got him. <laughs> hey, we need a sponsorship. There it is. That's hey, an eighteen. Calling out old hey, what's them right there? I got some Bud Light limes. I ain't never had him. Let me try. He's what he good. Really? Yes. He tastes like these with a lime in them. Yeah, I ain't got to bust a lime off either. Yeah. Bop. He's good. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna take you up, Sizzle. All right, y'all. Hey, y'all let yeah, me bro. know. Bud Light yeah. limes or no? I don't. Know. Better hope God you ain't in the zone I was at, baby. We <laughs> probably in, dude. Hey, I'm probably running the same dots as you. Hey, let me tell you something. Listen, if you're in a bad zone on this lake, it doesn't matter if you're fishing with dynamite. <laughs> You can have lightning bolts <laughs> at the end of your rod. Like, <laughs> you ain't gonna see. <laughs> I told my guy, 
<laughs> today at like 10. I looked at him and I went, it ain't gonna happen. I said, I'm in a bad zone. I'm in a bad, bad zone. Did you whoop whoop? I go out to the main lake. Yeah, I see the pieces. It's like, Titanic. We gotta, we gotta build it. First. Huh? And they gotta have the When I in. say like, to them, monster they, waves. They, they, they For real? About that. From the wind and giant yachts. Holy crap. For real. I'll tell you how bad it was. How long do you think it would have took me to run eight miles? How long? Yeah, there's yachts with 10 minutes. minutes. 45 minutes. No, you did not. I didn't do it. I drove two and a half miles and it took me 15 minutes. Nah. Swear to God. Swear to God. That's crazy. Whoa. I cased two waves. It was terrible. It was, it was really rough. But the problem, but the problem it was is that bad. Do that, it's not equal. Yes. It's not equal, though. Giant it's not equal from like one person cabin another, cruisers, like, cigar yeah, boats, five, ski boats. It was horrible. Worse than Travis. Way worse. You just wait. Yeah. <laughs> is it going to be sunny tomorrow? Yeah. Then Good luck. Be better hey, you, you, you better get where you're going. I'm not yeah, playing. Boy, this is not a competitive more. advantage. You better get where you're going at daylight because you're not running around. It ain't happening, bro. Yeah. All right, here we go. Getting ready to blast this bad boy off. Day one, group B. We're here. All right, we got to catch him up today, man. <clears throat> Wind's blowing a little bit. Sun finally came out. Been raining all practice. That wind blowing pretty hard. But well, that's going to make things a little bit challenging on a lot of people, including myself. But nevertheless, we got to get her done. No excuses. So we're going to get out here, put ourselves in a good position, and just fish hard. What we catch is what we catch, man. That's just how it goes. So I'll check back in with y'all momentarily. We're going to make this run, not far run, to our first hole, get set up, and uh, pull off them favorites, put them to work. All right, see you guys in a minute. Peace. All right, folks, we just pulled into our first stop. As you can see, I got some boat docks behind me. Surprise, there. This lake's loaded with boat docks. But uh, the plan for today is do a little sight fishing, or what I assume to be sight fishing, kind of throwing at these light spots where I know some beds are. You know, the thing with this deal is you don't know what guys did in group A, and it could be very frustrating. You might pull up to some fish uh, that are literally gone, or you might pull up to some fish that have been caught or tampered with and they just don't want to cooperate whatsoever that happens quite often so you know hopefully these are fresh fish that haven't been messed with i didn't mess with them in practice uh, i just kind of wanted to see that they were committed to the bed which all these fish that i'm pulling up on today are um, in between that we're gonna mix in just some fish and i'll just skip a lunker log around and throw swim bait too some uh, and then of course my floating worm you know that's always a big deal for me during the spawn so um, bounce back between a few different baits and uh, see if we can't catch some fish, man. I've yet to catch a big one since I've been here. So I'm due, man. I'm due. So got the good mojo going. I feel good this morning. Um, keep a close eye on score tracker. Make sure these guys ain't running away. But hopefully I'm towards the top of that bad boy. And, uh, and they're coming to look for me. So anyways. All right, guys. I'm going to get all my rods rigged up. Tinker just right. Put a little cologne on my baits. See if we can catch one. All right, see
That'll there work. we go. That ought to do it. That ought to get us on the board. Jeez, he was being difficult. Being difficult. Two nine. All right, let's put us on the board, baby. Oh, if we can get him off the thing. Thank you, fish. Jeez, you worked me hard, though. I don't like working that hard. <clears throat> All right, let's keep it rolling. One hour remaining period one. Three pounds, eight ounces. Hey, baby. Yes, sir. Let's go. There we go. That's what we need. All right, guys. We just ended period one. Uh, we got like six pounds, something like that. Maybe right at seven. Two bass um, off bed. Ran to a bunch of the beds, and uh, they were empty, vacant. Not really sure what's going on. But we just ended the period. I've been working on this one right here for probably 20 minutes. I've yet to get it to bite. It's a solid fish. It's going to help a lot if we can catch her. Um, man, I'm going to keep keep trying to get her to bite it's been tough but uh man we got our work cut out we got a lot of a lot of fish catching to do so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna probably sight fish for another period third period i'll probably just fish you know do my methylate trick worm and uh float worm you know do some things like that throw that swim bait around some and just try to draw some of those bigger bass out to bite that's what it's gonna take so we'll need to catch at least seven or eight keepers a day to stay in contention so that's the plan been so happy to see you two pounder man I'm I'm really just trying to throw this lunker log up to them and and like surprise them before they see me it's a lot easier to catch them when they don't see you so you know I can I can get them to bite this wacky worm sometimes so I'm trying to throw this up there first but of course when I see one go ahead and lock down on it but the problem is there's so many of those guys right there in between. It just makes it really difficult, to be quite honest. But <clears throat> that's part of it, though. They're not all going to be little like that. Here in a second, I'm getting ready to run. We're going to run to a fish that I know is at least three pounds. I fished for it for quite some time earlier and just couldn't get get her to bite for whatever the reason is i don't know why she didn't want to bite she just didn't it's very weird the way she was acting
right on. This should be a two, three. Two bones, five ounces. All right, that's him though. There we go. Thank you, fish. Touch. Oh. <laughs> All up in the mouth. You got it. Yes. I get a picture of that one too. Yes. Four pounds, five ounces. Yes, baby. Four, yes, five, sir. Four five. That other fish. Crazy. Absolutely awesome. nuts. Yeah. Come, 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 come talk to these people, bruh. What about everybody? What about it? What's what up, about bro? it, bro? Hey, hey J-Dub, leading the derb again. What are you doing, man? <laughs> what am I doing? I'm just... protesting you, bruh. <laughs> Catch too many gosh dang bass. <laughs> you got to quit doing that. What, what, what was that total? Uh, 47 pounds. 47? Why are you trying to... Wait, what you doing? Bro, I'm just trying to... Hey. What you doing, Terry? <laughs> <laughs> what you doing? Back up, Terry, back up. Back. This, this well, oh, you already good. knew. That was a good throw. We can't have no... Oh, tournament without these boys finding out some type of way to gamble we got dc and adrian on the same team and anybody hey, hey look at our board man look check this board. out hey i like this 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 throwback beavis and butthead beavis right. and butthead cornhole boards a little it's a little ragged out on the corners but hey beggars can't be choosers you know what i'm saying so so you got j-dub and brody brody the cameron game the cameraman also known as the bag slayer I saw you, bro. You drained one on your first throw. I played a couple. I played a couple rounds of cornhole. Okay. So did it, you? Okay. Look at this one right here. Hey, look. I used to watch this when I was younger, bro. <laughs> Beavis and Butthead was hella funny, bro. I ain't gonna even lie to you. How I got ringed in this? I don't know. They, hey, they, they can't. They went and woke my boy DC up out the bed. I'm about to get out. I'm about to walk up out of bed. Wake up out the bed. Lose fifty dollars. Hey, hold on a second. So we're playing. <laughs> we're playing no. You gotta have exactly twenty-one. Well, if you if you break, you go back yeah, to 15. Yeah, we've been playing that the whole time. All right, if you break, you go back to 15. Right, turn that light off. We knew we were playing that the whole time. <laughs> we literally, this is the first game. Right, what, what, what light? What are you talking about? Hey, my boy J.W. got a new truck. They got some bright-ass lights that he thought was going to work real good. And they ain't. Hey, where's the switch at? I got it. Oh, yeah, dude. Good morning, people. Here we go. This is day two. Group B. Me, Adrian, J.W. are all in group B. We are out here this morning getting ready, getting ready to take off and slide over to the ramp. And we got to catch them today. So I'm sitting in sixth place right now, but they caught them pretty good in group A, man. It took 34-11 to make the cut. And so you have to assume it's going to take at least that in our group as well. So I need to catch about 10, 11 pounds today, which I know doesn't sound like a lot, but conditions are not the easiest. Let me say that. So wind's blowing. It's going to be cloudy all day today. can only imagine... That's going to make it very difficult to sight fish, but we are definitely going to try that. But I'm going to mix in a lot of my floating worm, and I'm going to throw a, a swim bait around as well. I'm looking at my deck to see what we got going. Uh, and a wacky worm. Getting lots and lots of bites on wacky worms, but the problem is they haven't been keeping. So we're going to see. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, five, two.
failed three out of six. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, sir. We'll take a picture of that. We'll take a picture of that. Yes, sir. Let's do it. That one worked me hard, boy. I'll take that fish picture here in a little bit. Supposed to happen multiple times a day. I don't know what the deal be. With that. Three pounds, zero ounces. Three zero. For fatty. Man. Hungry. Fat little man. Three pounds, zero ounce. Didn't even have my camera on. Let me catch this one fish. Thank you. 